In the eyes of the Marshall football team, it's like surreal. You really, you can't. It's it has you speechless once you're out there. It's just a feeling comes over you like. Uh, it's, it's really something you just have to be around to see it, to feel it. The annual memorial ceremony for victims of the 1970 plane crash. Are part players. They put on the black uniform. Emphasizes the team's purpose. In the special white helmets, and something magical happens. Yep. How could it not? Because here, Robert Anthony Harris. Football is more than a game. Some people, this is all they have left, you know, from that memory. So uh, we're carrying that on our shoulders and on our chest every Saturday. I'd be fortunate enough as we are as most football players to be able to actually lay a rose down on the fountain uh, while that ceremony is going on. The Marshall football team is aware that it is a symbol of perseverance for the Huntington community. This fountain and the ceremony surrounding it are just as good a reminder as the uniforms the team wears every single week. As the fountain is turned off for the winter. No one has our story and um, I think that's what makes us so special is that we're not just playing for ourselves, we're playing for those 75 people that were lost in that plane crash. The theme of rebirth hits even closer to home for the 2017 squad. Everybody just came together so that's just like us this year turning around from last year to this year, everybody come together, you know. To put everything aside, no matter what it is, whether it's race people are or anything, you put everything aside and you come together for the 75. That is why we play for you, for them. Because with unity, we are Marshall. Anything is possible. In Huntington, Norman Seawright, 13 Sports Zone.